All right, guys, welcome to my channel, Anything Hawaii. Today, I'm trying to convert my golf cart to Yamaha 2006. Um, I forgot, it's G something, whatever, G22E. So you can check it out, G22E, Yamaha. Electric motor burned out, and I'm gonna convert it to gas. Right now, I've got a sprocket for the rear. Give me 12T. This is a three quarter. I'm sorry, this is a one inch. And the inside of this thing is a three quarters. And it's got a keyed quarter inch by a smaller one. I don't know yet, but um, if you guys leave a comment, I'll probably look it up and I'll tell you. And I'll comment back, but so. Right here was the 19 spline Yamaha gear. So what I did was I grinded this down with a grinder. Let me show you right here, there's my grinder. I used this, the sanding wheel. Then I grinded this down, down here. And I had somebody spin the tire and I lifted it back up just to fit this three quarter shaft. It's a three quarter bore to one inch. So this the inside diameter is three quarters. So now you can see it fits right in. I sanded it down and for the inside parts, I use a Dremel. Um, right here's my Dremel, you guys can see. And I use this little pointy thing. And I have, I have drilled this out like that. I just turned it on and drilled it in here like this um, so that I could fit my key. So now you can see, I can put this in here and my key will fit right in there. And then my shaft will slide over it and I'll lock down. You can see that? And my shaft will slide over it and lock down. Or you can take it out and put it the other way. Alright guys. My shaft will slide over it like this. And my key will lock down right here. So I just push this in still wiggly. And I weld it later, but that's all I did. Then you can take this key. Top is quarter inch. I forgot what the, the other one is. This little part here, see it? It's a smaller part. And watch this, the key will fit right in here. Right? And this thing is keyed also. So like you can see, it will slide right in. And this thing going here will be keyed. Locks right in here. Just make sure you guys do it right and lock these things down. Not much, but it will key like that. And then this thing we'll see it's keyed. And it locks it in. Alright guys, you like that? Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Um, I'll be doing some more videos for this uh, 2006 Yamaha golf cart. That's basically a lot of people's having questions about this shaft. This is an electric shaft, rear. And that's it. It spins this way to the front to go forward. Alright guys. This is a number 40. I put another number 40 for um, my chain. And once again, it's a 12T sprocket. Number 40 for the chain. And it's a one inch bore. So I have a one inch bore on the outside over here. And the inside diameter in here where my finger is. And the shaft is three quarters. All right, I did, so I did it like this so that I can buy any one inch bore sprockets like this and change the teeth. Right now I got 12T, I think everybody likes to use 10T. I couldn't find any 10T, so I just got a 12, just so I can continue my build. Um, if you like this once again, hit the like button, leave a comment. Uh, I'll try to get you whatever I know about this thing, all right? Take care.